Hi everyone, it's Shelley with InbalanceNaturally.com where we specialize in bringing out the goddess in you. I have dry skin, thirsty skin. If you do, stay tuned to our channel. Make sure to subscribe because that's what we cover is natural skin care. It's not multi-level. It's not these expensive things. It's things that my friends have been asking me about for years. Shelley, you're always collecting things that are more natural. They are $25, $30, $40, and for something that's going to last months and months, that is a good deal. No high fragrance, no fillers, no chemicals that are going to do more damage than good to your skin. Because as we age, we really need to take care of our skin. At least I do. So that's what one of my life commitments is about. And friends have asked me to share this information as well as to do reviews on products, drugstore products today that I find very useful. I work at a high-end cosmetic counter advising women and selling lotions that are $200 and mascaras that are $30. And today we're going to talk about one of my favorites. It's L'Oreal Voluminous Butterfly. Now there are two but this is not the red package where the, there's the butterfly on both sides. I absolutely, whoops, did it the wrong way. I absolutely love this. And I've jumped back and forth lately looking for different mascaras. And women always ask me, well, how do you not get it all over your lid? Well, first of all, you start as close to the base as you can of the lash without making yourself have the blink, blink, blinks. And then you do a very light coat, go up to the top of the lash, and I'm barely touching the lash. And then on the bottom, a lot of women say, well, I don't have much lash. Well, let's find out because that's what mascara is all about. So one of the techniques that I teach at the high-end beauty counter that we try, everything is trial and error for everyone the first time or two. Put the wand barely sitting on the lash and very gently go back and forth and then lift it. And you'll have a little bit on the lash. Back and forth. Back and forth. And then you can add to that. And I'm barely, barely touching it. It's kind of like a butterfly wing that's just breezing by the edge of a flower. And there you have it. See? Much nicer than the one without. So there's another mascara that I tried. Let me just show you that. So this is a short video that I didn't like, and I'll tell you why I didn't like it. It's Maybelline Colossal. It's a nice brush. It's very clean design, not too big and bulky if you have bigger eyes like I do. But what I didn't like about the Maybelline Colossal was it didn't deposit the mascara on the ends of the lashes. I mean, the ingredients went on the ends of the lashes, but it didn't seem to coat the ends of the lashes as well as the L'Oreal <clears throat> Voluminous Butterfly have it upside down. All right, ladies, look forward to answering your questions and talking to you soon. If you're in San Diego, we look forward to meeting you for one of our spa treatments and one-to-one -one makeup lessons because beauty brings out the confidence in you, even if it's only a one eyeshadow look. And we'll be doing a video on that very soon, so be watching for that. This is Shelly with InbalanceNaturally.com, helping you with natural skin care, skin care services to help with lines and wrinkles, and one-to-one -one makeup lessons for you. So whether you're dating, you're married, you're working, or you're playing, I want you to look your best. Bye for now.